This is for cancer, so I'm rising to be the size. This is for cancer. My name is D. Reader the Mean All's here for those of y'all that are new. And welcome to the Mean All channel. Well, I appreciate y'all for being here and thank y'all so much. Let's see what's coming in for cancer right now. And always remember these readings are donation based. So if you are wanting to continue to see content for cancer or you haven't been seeing consistent content, that's because we have not had a cancer sent in. So be that cancer big stepper and send in for your side, y'all. I appreciate y'all and thank y'all so much. We're going to read all of those jumpers. So we got the high priestess. We're starting off with a water feminine energy. This could be you. And we got the prince of cups. So some of you could be dealing with a masculine energy, but he loves attention. And we got power in reverse. Somebody got before you roll four is going to be your lucky number right now. So there could be a power struggle in the connection. And I do see the fool. So maybe you weren't expecting this coming in or this type of relationship is something that you're a little, you know, unfamiliar with. We got the sun. This could be with a Leo. So it does look like something is coming to light, especially if you are dealing with a Leo. And we got happiness in reverse. So some of you are with a Leo and it's like, you're secretly miserable with this Leo. You might not be letting it be known to the world, but you are not happy with this Leo. You're convincing yourself that you're happy. Somebody got a nine-year-old and we got the queen of disc in reverse. So I'm seeing an older feminine cancer. So this could be for my cancer women, especially take what energy resonates and leave what doesn't. And then we got gain. So, I do see some type of financial increase for cancer. Maybe you did something recently to increase your finances, whether this is a loan or, you know, some type of inheritance or going into business for yourself or maybe just asking somebody for some money. I don't know. There's something coming in financially for cancer. We got the Knight of Cups in reverse. He likes to get you drunk, get you high, and get you to do what he wants you to do. Be careful. I do see the death card. Um, he could be a water sign himself. He could be a cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. He could have one of these signs in his charts. But I do see something coming to an end with him. I do see a Gemini coming in. Some of you could be with him right now or you could be with a Gemini. Some of you could be balancing or trying to juggle both, especially for my cancers that are, you know, dealing with more than one person right now. I do see a Gemini in the picture for those of you that are in a relationship. I do see marriage with completion and love. So that could be maybe the relationship going to the next level. That could be a goal for you. I do see some type of family dynamic. The number 10 is going to be important for cancer as well. Let's see what... Okay, these are, this this deck is just wanting to jump. But you know what? We always going to read jumpers. So we about to read all of these. Let's see what else is coming in right now. So we got the hey man showing up in reverse. And then we also have... Okay, so for a lot of my cancers, you could have felt like somebody maybe took advantage of you in a vulnerable moment, especially with the princess of wands showing up in art. I'm getting that a lot of you were in your vulnerable stage or you were in a stage to where your primary focus was elsewhere. So you weren't really paying attention to the signs that the universe was sending you. And I'm getting a lot of you now are worried about the situation or worried about the outcome. So 333 is definitely going to be the angel numbers for cancer right now. Let's see what else is coming in for my cancers. I appreciate y'all and thank y'all so much. So we got the Prince of this and the Princess of Cups. We got a cancer that's into fashion or a designer. We also got a cancer that works in like IT. Just want to throw that out there. We got the moon in the tower. So there is going to be some type of transitional period in your career. So this could be things coming to an end for some of you. And then for some of you, this could be your career elevating. And we got luxury showing up and wealth showing up in reverse. So some of you are struggling right now. We got a cancer that is manifesting luxury and manifesting wealth, but at this current moment, a lot of you are struggling, so it's kind of hard for you to see things differently. We got the Prince of Swords showing up in reverse and Ruin showing up in reverse. Maybe you were your own blockage cancer and you didn't realize that till now. Um, don't forget to like, share, subscribe, y'all. And for those of my cancers that would like to continue to see content for cancer, if you're on YouTube, send a super like. If you're on TikTok, send to the CA, y'all. I appreciate y'all and thank y'all so much. So we got success. So maybe you took an L recently, but looks like you're bouncing back with unlikely in reverse. 
Things are going to turn around for you, Cancer. Trust the process. We got yes. So a lot of you keep asking me, am I going to be successful this year? The answer to that is yes, Cancer. This following year coming up. A lot of y'all are pretty much done as far as this year. Y'all are more focused on next year. A lot of y'all are asking me, will you be relocating or moving this year? The answer to that is no. Now, this is general, of course, so take what energy resonates and leave what doesn't. Um, for those of you that do have a living situation going on, I am getting that your situation will improve. But are you going to be moving? They said no again. So this is that confirmation. You're still going to be where you're at. Things are just going to get a little better for you at the moment. They want you to get more information about where exactly you're wanting to move. Especially for those of my cancers that are wanting to relocate somewhere far. I do see you relocating next year because we got yes. So a lot of my cancers are like, well, will I relocate next year? The answer to that is yes. When next year? Not exactly sure. This is general, of course, but this is what I'm getting. So if it resonates, it resonates. This is October the 5th. So this is your begin. This is your end of the week reading, but readers are timeless. So if it resonates, it resonates. We got trust and we got be assertive. So for those of my cancers that are in this connection and wondering, well, what can I do to make my connection better? You have to apply that trust into this connection. That's the problem. Your relationship doesn't have any trust. Even if you got to ask help from others, like other married couples or other, you know, mutual friends that are in relationships, whatever you got to do to keep this connection going. I do see within a few months, things could be different. If this is something that you can work towards, I do see an opportunity here for things to improve or at least go to another level. So if this is, you know, living in separate households, this could be moving together. If this is just a regular relationship, this could be engagement. This could be engagement to marriage, whatever direction you're wanting this to go. But communicating clearly is going to be key. That's going to be the biggest thing right now, Cancer. If you can't do that, then this is going nowhere. What's the final message for Cancer? I appreciate y'all and thank y'all so much. We got in and their future and remain positive. So for those of my cancers that are struggling financially and you keep praying and asking God and asking the universe, when is my breakthrough? When am I going to finally be able to just woo side? You don't even, you're not even asking to be rich. A lot of you are just asking for some form of comfortability. At the bottom of the deck, this is the perfect time to ask God or the universe or Whoever you pray to for what you are wanting. I appreciate you, Cancer. Thank you.